narrative, of course, is about a young man in the mid-70s who is discovering his sexuality. He lives in a small town. He's thinking about what his future is going to be like. And uh, that's actually my biography. And so I really wanted to have the opportunity to tell this story because, not just because it reflected mine, but because I think it's so important for us to hear um, these stories of compassion and empathy about people's experiences, especially at this time in our history. The 1970s can feel like a really long time ago, but it, it really isn't. And yet, so much has now changed with the internet and how we listen to music. When I get out of here, just you wait and see. When I get out of here, the things I'm gonna be. When I get out of here, the world will holler, yes! I will dress in the latest New York style and folks will smile as I ride by. And also the idea of an album being this thing that you could take into your room, close the door, and it was a world unto itself. And it was a whole ritual of the graphics and being able to read the lyrics on the sleeve. It was a physical experience of music, which is so different from now, right? It's just this this thing that streams to us, but to actually have a physical object that you would put on the turntable and drop the needle. is throughout this country there are gay people there are gay people in every town in America and some of them are leading um, lives in which they're not free to be themselves where they don't um, have that freedom and where they might actually even endanger themselves by um, claiming their identity yeah I mean I mean there's a there's a there's one song in the show called gotta get out of here which is this, it's, it's, it's a song that embodies all of those things, which is I'm using all the materials of my life to take myself to a new place. I don't know where, I don't know how that's going to happen, but music is going to be the thing that takes him to the next place. 